Jason Manford, 41, said he had to delete the tweets after receiving an unprecedented outpour of vitriol and nastiness from offended IMA celebrity fans. The row began when it was confirmed that Matt Hancock had made it into the final of the ITV show, having beaten the likes of Mike Tyndall and Sean Walsh. As the controversial politician continues to divide opinion, a user named Chris commented on Twitter, You guys? I'm far from Matt Hancock's biggest fan but maybe questioning the nation's low IQ levels isn't the way to go about things on a Saturday night. Jason then replied, I think people voting for Matt Hancock are thick, or naive, I stand by that. Chris then responded with a screenshot of Jason's now-deleted tweet, which read, Well they shouldn't keep being such thick CS them should they? Sick, and Jason added, Also thick CS yeah, I stand by that too. Another user named Alright Fans came to Jason's defense saying that he was spot on and that anyone watching adults getting gunged for a month is brain dead. However, when Jason deleted his initial tweet, the user tweeted him again, at Jason Manford bottled it fella. Jason then explained that the trolling he had received left him with no choice but to delete the tweets. He said, mate, I couldn't deal with the level of vitriol and nastiness leveled at me for something that I thought would be common sense. So sorry I had to delete but honestly, some of the messages I was getting were on another level. However, the drama didn't end there, and another user slammed Jason's views on the COVID pandemic. The user, travel underscore junkie, raged, unfortunately, Manford comes from the school of thought that we didn't lock down quick enough, should have been harder and face masks work ever so well. He also thinks the vaccines are amazing. It's all in his stand-up act making fun of people that disagreed with it all. Defending himself, Jason hit back, that is a very simplistic version of what I say in my comedy act. If you were listening to what I said though, my opinion is that I don't know, and that the problem with the modern world is everyone is forced into picking a side on things they don't know about. Sick, the opinionated user didn't stop there and retaliated once again, writing, Always liked your stand-up Jason, you're a funny guy. But it's really disappointing when anyone who questions the COVID agenda is just labeled a granny killer. If it weren't for some of us standing up to this nonsense, the economy would be in an even worse condition. And Jason replied, I didn't call anyone a granny killer. What I said was I don't know. And more people need to admit they don't know. Personally, I wore a mask, had my vaccine and agreed with the first lockdown, when it was an unknown quantity. I don't regret any of my choices. The final of Emma Celebrity. Get me out of here. Airs at 9pm on ITV.